So the home show is now moving to downtown Grand Ledge, and I'm standing at a business that you may know and recognize and be familiar with. It's been around longer than I have, but I'm standing here at McDowell's Fireplace with Bruce McDowell. How are you? Very good. Thanks, Rochelle. I want to welcome you and your viewers to our showroom here. Thank you so much. And it's an incredible showroom with so many different types of fireplaces. Can you tell me a little bit about what you guys offer here? We offer uh, gas fireplaces, wood burning fireplaces, electric fireplaces, fireplace doors, fireplaces, fireplaces, fireplace inserts, uh, stoves, gas logs, just about everything. What is this that we have, we're standing right here in front of? We are looking at some of the fireplace doors. Uh, okay. If you have a fireplace and you don't have a set of doors for it, or maybe the set of doors that you have is tired or you're new, looking for a new look, uh, we feature the fireplace doors by Stoll Industries out of South Carolina. Terrific doors. They're built to order, so you pick the color, the size, the combination of finishes. Um, it's, a, it's a quality product, and, and we're proud to have it here. Can you show me what else you guys have here? Yeah, I'd like to show you another product by Stoll. So first, tell me, what is a reface design? The reface is particularly for existing manufactured fireplaces. And maybe you're looking for a different look. Not only do you get a new set of doors, but this whole face is made the size of the black face of the fireplace and just connects on magnetically. So you just, boom, you just change the whole look dramatically. There are gas fireplaces and there are wood fireplaces, is that correct? That's correct. So what are the two, what are the pros and cons of each? Well, gas, of course, is convenient. Mm -hmm. uh, wood has uh, more of a lifestyle commitment to it. Okay. Uh, but many people don't use their wood fireplaces often because they're busy and they just right. don't have time to bother. Where with the gas, you can just come home, turn it on, and enjoy it for the evening and turn it off. That's awesome. Well, can you show me more that you have here? Sure, I'd like to. Here we're looking at gas logs. If you have a wood burning fireplace, but you're looking for the convenience to have a fire more frequently, a gas log can be a great choice. It does give you some warmth to the room and it does give you the ambiance and it's a, it's a nice way to enjoy the fireplace. It could be used with or without doors that we were talking about. So if you like the idea of an open hearth fireplace without a piece of glass between you and the fire, but you still want the convenience of gas, a gas log is a great choice. Usually within 15 or 20 minutes, you can feel some significant gain off of it. If you're looking for more heat than that, then we're gonna take a look at the gas fireplace inserts. Bruce, tell me, first of all, what is an insert? A gas insert is a gas log and burner in its own firebox with its own heat exchanger. If you like the, the convenience of the gas as the gas logs that we were talking about, but you'd like to use it a lot and you'd like it to be a good heater too, the gas insert does change the performance of the fireplace. A traditional fireplace, the chimney is an exhaust only system. That's where the air goes, the heat goes, a lot of heat from the house goes that way. A gas insert is a sealed combustion unit, a direct vent unit. Awesome. Well, before we move into the next section, guys, I'm going to keep heating up over here, okay? Bruce, if you want to put your hands next to me. <laughs> so, Bruce, tell me, what are we standing in front of right now? We're standing in front of wood-burning fireplace inserts. We've been talking about gas and, and the gas inserts as a way to increase the efficiency of the fireplace. Many people are still very happy burning wood and want to burn wood. So it's something that could be used to heat a zone of the house or possibly more. That's awesome. So let's keep taking a look around here. So now I think I am at the hottest place in the store. We're now standing in front of a wood stove. And Bruce, tell me a little bit about this appliance. The wood stove is uh, an efficient, clean way to burn wood and be an effective, efficient heater. If you don't have a fireplace in your house, um, we can install a freestanding wood stove. There is something about what a lot of people will call a real fire. Um, it's, it's very enjoyable, it's controlled. You can get a lot of heat off of it or you can throttle it down and have a fire that lasts overnight. So Bruce, clearly you have an assortment of different types of stoves. Tell me about this one that we're standing in front of. This is a gas freestanding stove. It looks like a wood stove, but it's actually burning gas. 
So here we have the look of a wood stove, but the convenience of gas. These just need to vent outside. They don't have to vent up above the roof like a traditional wood burning unit would. Okay. So this can be for any room in the house. This could replace an existing wood stove with a convenient gas stove. It could be installed as a zone heater, even in a basement where it's a little bit cool all the time. So these are temperature controlled. Uh, it's like a gas furnace, but it just looks like a wood stove. One more choice that we have is the electric option. These are electric fireplace inserts. These can insert into an existing fireplace or these can be built in as a traditional fireplace too. So the electric fireplaces, we don't look for them to be heaters. Anything that can plug into a typical outlet can only give you about the same amount of heat as a blow dryer. Right. Okay. You know, so there are heaters in them. It can contribute to the warmth of a zone, but mostly it's just for the visual ambiance. All right, Bruce, tell me about this gas fireplace. This is a product that can be installed in a home, in any room, and it can be enclosed with wood framing and faced out with whatever choice you'd like to have, mantle, stone, tile, whatever. And it can give you the performance of the gas fireplace inserts up around that 80% range, okay. but do it in a traditional built-in look if you don't have a fireplace. Well, Bruce, thank you so much for showing me everything that you have to offer here at McDowell's Fireplace. Clearly, as you guys can see, they've been serving the community here for 40 years, and I completely understand why. So make sure you stay tuned for more Studio 10 Home Show after the break.